Hey Joel, what's up? Hi, hi. All fine? Yeah, yeah, what's up? I can't hear you. One second. Can you hear me now? Yeah, yeah, I can hear you. All good, though? Yeah, let's just wait for Maria to join. Yeah, sure, sure. Uh, hi guys, uh, just a few technical issues. So thank you all for joining. So this is just our first live, and this is basically, as you all know, uh, it's, it's one year of Argumenter. So do stay tuned to the session. We'll also be introducing a few uh, fresh faces as well uh, on the podcast as such. So I think as of now we're ready for Maria. So I hope she's on the. I think she's on the call. So let me check. I'll try again. Ah, oh, she's there. <laughs> Funny, I don't know. No, yeah, fine. Hi. Hi, Maria. Hello. Hello, hello. I was trying through my laptop, but just okay. It was a little hard, fine. Cool, cool. Yeah. So happy anniversary yeah, to us, guys. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's fine now. Uh, yeah, perfect. So, uh, so well, I think we'll just wait for two more minutes and then we'll just be starting with regard to the proceeding. There's no formal, yes. thing, guys, so it's just going to be uh, us talking about our journey yeah, as well as our argument. And yeah, just a formality with an. It'll be one of those sessions that we are here without a prep, you know, uh, a session without a prep per se. So it's yeah. gonna be <laughs> pretty good. Yeah. So I think we can start now. Okay. So hi everyone, and uh, this is Argument the podcast, and all of you must okay, whoever joined the live, you guys must be already knowing that myself, I'm Joel. and that's minaj to my bottom left and that's maria to my bottom mm-hmm. right and uh, we are the co-founders of argumenter so minaj and maria uh, what what took you like why why did you stay on to this venture for like one year don't you think it's just a, a bit too tad long considering the fact that yeah, so i think people... before we get into all of that let's give them a little back story so joel just hit us up one day and he was like guys i have this idea of starting a podcast channel and i was like sure why not let's see where this goes and it was exactly a year ago and uh, i mean it was a bit of a struggle we were all new to this whole recording of podcasts and everything like that first we thought okay fine let's just have a conference call and record that and upload a podcast and then we went from that to using zoom meetings and recording our zoom videos and then trying out different editing styles trying out different versions of content and one thing that stayed consistent is is the three of our determination towards making this channel want yeah. to grow and i'm pretty sure all of you have been annoyed by the amount of pr we do <laughs> almost every day but i mean it means it means a lot and your support has been so overwhelming and we're nothing but grateful to all of you listening to us yeah even my case was different because when joel told me about the idea of having a podcast i had to go and google what does this really mean is this is something It does it have something to do with what I know? So uh, that was, uh, you know. But uh, once we started doing it, we definitely had fights, we had arguments, we fought in a WhatsApp group, we had a lot of discussions. But at the end of the day, we three had something in common, which came forward, you know, to be a group, to be a, you know, a, a happy group. I would say. I mean, I, I really feel always comfortable to have good conversations with them. So uh, really, really happy to be here. You know, after one year, like we are in one. to go for story well because is our versions from your end <laughs> yours has to come now yeah so i think uh, i think we we propose the i think i think we are we also join with uh, salman he's actually a very good podcast that you can just check check him out also on instagram so if you if you can find someone by the name of salman need a job he's he's a, he's a really good uh, podcast and also he does great inter- interview as well But re- but regarding the podcast as such, we uh, I felt that at least considering the lockdown and we, since there was ample amount of time at least in the beginning of the lockdown because we were supposed to have our 
uh, exams and then it got postponed and that particular gap was that one particular time when the saturation level was pretty high so you just wanted to do something in order to engage yourself but i was about that how about we try doing with regard to like explainers or like or, or maybe like uh, like i told the idea to maria maria Mar- Mar- was like she had an idea of trying to bring about webinar videos or trying to like uh, do a bit of, of teaching or or lecturing and uh, i felt like okay yeah, that, that's a great idea but then what about we talk about several issues are happening around us in a lot more uh, conversation based uh, conversational manner uh, as such so that's why we came up with the idea of the podcast and that's how i think our first episode was on the especially that particular time to discuss the china and india border dispute and that mm. that was actually a uh, It, it it taught us how to go ahead because the the kind of feedback which we received was, was quite overwhelming because it's our first podcast as well and uh, many people were like okay it's actually good plus it sounds more like a panel discussion it's not like a conversation as such because the podcast is where you involve yourself in like it's more candid it's a lot more you have to you have your facts you have everything in your, in, in in play but also you need to keep, you need to calm yourself down and also try to like you know blend in and and things like that so that's one thing which the reason why we we went along with the podcast as such yeah that's the genesis and we had a, you know we had a few goals in our mind when we went into the idea of a podcast because one thing i was at uh, you know i just told them also i was very consistent in one thing it has to be simple it has to be simple in language and you know simply adding into complexity will make it really hard for the audience to understand so we made sure that when we prepare also we make sure that it's something in simple language and every opinion we received every feedback we receive after each session was something so much overwhelming and so much important because every constructive criticism we received from the end of the audience was really much useful for us you know in our part as well and uh, minaj i think like we used to discuss in the group also like uh, from three of our sides three different groups of people you know three different groups of communities respond to how we work on it so it definitely has been an overwhelming experience for us like throughout the year per se yeah and like jewel said it earlier i mean your support and your feedback cannot be undervalued here we we've taken everybody's feedback into account and made the changes where we started to give you some context we started off a year ago and before we would like plan out okay let's talk about this let's talk about that and all of us were very rigid and we didn't really know how to move about the sessions but then through your feedback we got many of you saying okay you know guys you need to relax a little bit be a little more candid mm-hmm. because we're having a conversation and not lecturing anybody and that kind of feedback really helped us grow to become what we are today and and hopefully grow even bigger and reach greater heights Uh, we are still growing towards a uh, hundred subscribers at this point one year but well, that's uh, it's a great start when we like uh, we obviously the the context is that you have to you have to differentiate between views and also with regard to are you more uh, inclined towards like, getting the maximum amount of uh, eyeballs or you want to get the content out but also it, but at, at the final point every content creator or, or anyone who's in the space wants to see because like, views encourage somebody to move ahead with regard to what he or she wants to do so i think that's one thing uh, when uh, we would like to see and, and, and look forward as well and Jill, somebody yeah. has some criticism in the comment section when do we get to see joel clean shaven well, is this oh. that <laughs> 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 okay that that makes sense <laughs> that has to be read <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Like, uh, like even when come, you know, when we come back to this, uh, how far, how how many people would have uh, gone through the work that we have done, or how many people, how many viewers have we got until date? I think one of the biggest appreciation we uh, we would have had. I mean, we had this year was definitely the feature that we got in edX. I mean, uh, that was something so so overwhelming because on a fine day morning we we received this invite, we received this call from there. And, we were so much happy on that day because every single appreciation every single criticism matters because it simply proves that you watch it you see it you understand something from it is what that mattered okay <laughs> okay ryan has come up with something <laughs> joel you're getting so much of fan comments in the comment box i okay <laughs> he might have gone to school in pain just there so uh, like we said it's uh, something that's uh, you know we don't have isn't even on the days ahead we definitely are in need of your support are in need of your opinions because that matters a lot in us to improve at least i mean i have felt inside my conscience that we have developed i mean we have bettered a lot 
uh, compared to what we did in the first episode. Like if you look back our previous episodes and all, I think we definitely came a long way back, and we still have a long way to go. So, do you guys feel the same? Like we, uh, I mean, you must agree to the fact that we need opinions that really, really matter to the people. Yeah, so, what absolutely. do you feel about that? Absolutely. So, uh, I mean, up until we got the feature on edX, we were really skeptical about how we were moving forward in our journey forward. And uh, you know, it comes in the face of every new venture. Like, for example, to give you our context. we started off and then the views were fluctuating and then we were trying to come up with ways so that we can increase views we tried to touch upon topics that are more sensitive and that would generate more views and uh, reach more audience and and that sort of taught us that you know uh, it doesn't really matter if we get one view or a thousand views but as long as long as we uh, touch somebody's heart and make them more sensitive towards the incidents occurring all around the globe and even india for example that's what we strive and aspire to do as being argumenters we want everybody to be a part of the uh, be a part of the narrative and uh, have an opinion if not take a take a particular side and i think that's mm-hmm. something that's humbled us a lot to know that there are people actually listening to us and taking our fee- uh, taking our views into consideration and and uh, being educated about the current affairs and things that are happening across the globe yeah like 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 the, the, the two of them said about the edx because uh, one day we, like it just, it just happened to this, just receive this mail that you know uh, from from this uh, journalist by the name of rush uh, miss sashri patil uh, patil and uh, she was actually working in the new internet express and then she like uh, would like to talk to you with regard to how the podcast is and then we felt like, okay so now since they gotten featured uh, as well on the edx uh, how about we look, look into like branching out into a different type of content because Uh, the podcast is not exactly a good idea, but also trying to. I'm not saying emulate a media company, but also trying to include facets of explainers or even uh, series uh, as such. So, and also uh, one more thing which I'd like to add is that uh, I, I think two three weeks back, if you guys must have seen the link with regard to joining the argumenter team, uh, that is where we have received a fair amount of response concerning concerning our, our numbers as well, but also around. around 13 to 15 response we got so we got at least four five lawyers and we also got quite a few students as well and uh, we we would appreciate that as they come forward with regard to joining us uh, as a part of the team and as of now in the call i think we are joined with uh, atul uh, rishvi and nidli so i think it would be great we we, we could uh, bring them on to the panel as such uh, as many i mean if you would like to say something before we uh, bring the two of uh, bring the three of them into the panel yeah at, i mean to tell you why we wanted to have more people in team argumento initially we thought okay fine the three of us can just sail this through and then we realized that uh for you guys also would be pretty exhausting just seeing the same faces with the same kind of views because mm-hmm. you know me for an instance i'm a little diplomatic and then maria was on one end jewels on one end they might have their own opinions and mm-hmm. it would be pretty monotonous pretty monotonous <laughs> moving in the same uh I think my brother has. Minna, I guess, I guess you saw that. <laughs> yeah, and uh, I'm yeah, sorry, I just broke out. I I, I, I lost yeah. my mind. What was I even saying? <laughs> yeah, and uh, we, we wanted to. Is, we yeah. wanted to get some more people. We wanted to get different views, different perspectives, different ideologies, and uh, make it all a part of argumento. And I think that's something that's taught us all a lot about actually having something that we really care about and really nurture, and. Yeah, I mean, it would be great if you guys could uh, listen to them and hear them and ask to why they wanted to join a team argument as well. I think Joel, you can add them one. And even like, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah, even yeah. like when we began, also we had this uh, one dream. I mean, one plan. Like we being three students, we definitely had our limitations. But at the end of the day, what we had was we wanted our opinions to be raised, our voices to be raised out to the. so say we that we have something to say so we are really much happy like we have all these people with us because they are here with full enthusiasm so much zeal is people are there you know to join our team we are really really happy to have you on board as well yeah uh, i think now we are joined with atul uh, atul abi are you i are you audible and yeah atul is there okay i'll just try adding the next person all right Yeah. Okay. So, okay, the, it's saying three members on the team. Okay, I think I should leave them. How do I exit? 
Oh, because, okay, yeah. So the reason why uh, it's showing only three members in the team is uh, because uh, he's actually in in the, in the Emirates. So only when the two of you leave, and then maybe when he joins, then you you guys can also also come back, I guess. Or or yeah, I just really. try adding him. Okay, yeah, it, it's yeah, showing three guys, three guys only. So I think okay. the two of the two of you, if you could leave and then join back again uh, after he after he joins in then. Yeah. Fine. fine. Mm, okay. All right. Stay on the audience only. I'll just call you at the moment. Yeah, yeah. So guys, just a few technicalities. Uh, Atul, I think. Uh, Atul, am I audible? And okay, I think that there is a bit of a of a lag from his end. Uh, Maybe VPN might work. I thought if you could just try that, since I, th- I think Insta doesn't work in uh, there. But uh, okay, I'll just call in the two of them and also call in uh, the next person. I think is uh, on the list. I see is Natalie. So okay, I'll just, I'll just like uh, I'll invite him. I thought that's fine. Yeah, I thought am I. audible and i think I, i can't see you so okay i, I think there's a there's a bit of a technical issue so if we could just join back maybe maybe it's uh, the, the better things so I, i think I'll, i'll just add the two then also the next person yeah yeah okay like he, i i don't think he is able to join it so i think Yeah, guys, if, you really, if you want to ask us any questions please let us know in the comment section it would be great to make this section very interactive okay uh yes yeah, so, so uh, i i think till the time when the the issue was solved or i think if, if atul could just fix the issue or with the other vp no vp no anything uh it would request like the audience if they have any questions regarding the argument of podcast and what we can do as such so we have a few projects in plan as to what we intend to do as such but we would love to hear you all as to what you would like us to do in the next uh, upcoming uh, event and what kind of what kind of content should we focus on uh, priorly because though we say we are political social and legal uh what are the different things which which we can try to emphasize on now it it'll be great if you just point out in the in the comment section or also we can add it to the live live session as such if needed yeah even if not now uh you definitely have points to contact us because you check the check the bio of the uh account we definitely have uh, you know you can definitely reach out to us anytime you want because we value this a lot uh, like i said before we value each and every opinion a lot and even when joel was asking okay guys what we will speak in the live what are we supposed to talk about in the live so although we said okay we'll go unprepared because it's just going to be a candid session the only word that came to me was gratitude because uh, uh, you know no one has sit in okay we're not just playing with all those filters i was playing with that but i don't know how these filters were so just quit it then so like i said uh, the only word that came was gratitude because for years i had i i uh touch wood for yours ahead uh, that is uh, to come forward definitely the only intention we had then and we have now is to uh, raise the voice to raise each and everyone's voice each and that has to be respected and mattered so uh, what we focus more is uh, definitely on contemporary contemporary social legal and political issues so that's the whole point of it i think nidley has joined with us nidley it will be great if you could uh, share to us your experience with argument till now um i'm now audible Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Yeah. So I still remember the first time I saw you, saw all of you guys. So I think it was on Instagram. Um, one of your sessions on uh, same-sex marriages. I think that was the session that I first got to know about all of you people. So yeah, uh, it it was a very you know a diverse panel as well as the way the ex- opinions were being allowed to express, and that's something that I liked a lot. So that that motivated me to join join the group. uh so yeah i mean i'm i'm grateful that you guys did yeah, it please come at least come with a full prepared speech gratitude and all uh, <laughs> <laughs> exactly like joel wanted exactly like joel wanted and everybody did prepared so you're perfectly okay, done that much like just introduce yourself yeah introduce yourself and what do yeah, you do yeah, yeah. 
Yeah, so hi guys, I'm, I'm Nightly uh, and I'm a third year law student at School of Law, Paris University. And uh, my key areas of interest uh, include uh, forensic law, criminal law, and public international law. Um, so yeah, so uh, this more and, and even being a UPSC aspirant, like, you know, I do keep a check on all the political issues that, that's going on in and around. So I, I uh, this is how I got to know about their podcast. So yeah, that motive motivated me to yeah, join their podcast. Oh, UPSC. That's great. So you're actually preparing for the UPSC thing? Sorry? You're actually preparing for the exam or something or, or basically like you're planning to do it after the entire course? No, not preparing for now. Uh, I joined law school for that, but then I like law more than, you know, current affairs and all these things. But but yeah, that, that's still an option. Uh, so I'm, I'm looking into what else I can explore. So yeah. That's great. I think Maria also... Uh, must be a UPSC yeah. <laughs> I was silent. I was listening to it. I know Joel will make some comment. I was like silent. Okay, fine. I won't talk about this now. I I am. I am definitely am <laughs> since my childhood. So that's a big dream of mine. So I'm definitely working towards it. An argument is definitely a a huge you know a bridge towards it because uh, argument requires you uh, definitely demands you to learn learn about things when you come forward because we cannot come forward with yeah. the video and speak something and leave. That's not something argument to expect. Yeah. So. I definitely have to work in this. So when that works, it's definitely a very useful thing for our UPSC yeah, dreams as well. So for people who are listening to this, uh, this is definitely a huge, huge thing for your UPSC as well because we come prepared for this session. It's going to be useful for you as well in a simple, you know, in simple language. So nice that's the offer we have. <laughs> yeah. So uh, yeah. is anyone else joining, bro? Yeah, yeah. So I, I also I do meeting. check out. Yeah, I'll just leave the meeting so that Atul can join. No, I think he can only join when when all of us leave. So I think I, I maybe I'll try doing the second live maybe uh, uh, accordingly and then add him first and accordingly add two more because I think they are, it's some maybe, system like maybe in the meantime you could add Rishvi. I'll just get in touch with Atul. All right, sure, sure, sure. So also guys, do check out Nightly's new uh, explainer. It's children on, on the uh, retrospective taxes as such. So uh, what, what, one question to uh, Nidalee is that how, how did you approach with regard to, because we, we, we did give a fair idea about how to go with the explainer as such. But um, how, how did you process with regard to uh, what kind of information you'd like to deal in and uh, how you want to present with regard to the, the video as such? It's, it's the latest video, guys. So we, we can check out on YouTube and also on Instagram as well. So yeah, uh, Nidalee, how did you proceed with that? Okay, I'll keep few things confidential because <laughs> yeah, at the end of the day, like, yeah, it's the podcast. But, uh, but uh, yeah, basically reading newspaper articles and uh, there was this especially one uh, uh, one article written by Hari Sarve that I found, which is like very helpful to prepare. Uh, yeah, that's how I approached uh, this topic about. And I remember Joel, Joel telling us like, you know, there was this one session where I didn't really come prepared and I told him I'll be really prepared and I'll do extensive research on whatever topic that I'm doing. So yeah, that's how I went about it. So yeah, big shout out to like any UPSC aspirants, please uh, log into the channel because this is one place where they, we don't even, fo- we it's not only we focus on fact, but the opinions are even more important. That's what they look at your answers also. In in why if you are preparing for UPSC, so yeah. And that's the whole point. I mean, like yeah, like I had been uh, saying, it's not a marketing though. Okay, so we're not marketing this. We're just saying that uh, it's something that comes out of uh, something yeah. out of heart because we don't mean to uh, you know reverberate what's there on the paper. We are not here to reverberate what's there on your channel. Rather, uh, because if that was the case, it would have been just a news reporting. That's not something what we have been intending. It would be very simple in language per se because we just want this thing to reach you. We just want to make sure that diverse opinions uh, definitely matter in the society. It's not just that we should not we should disrespect somebody's opinion just because that person is different. Because even if our if you take three of us, me, Joel, and Minaj only, Minaj, like he said, is Joel is an extreme. That's the whole point of the <laughs> sessions we have. But at the end of the day, even if uh, even if we just come up with some arguments, all that we're trying to say is the three perspectives, uh, you know, three elements of society have. 
which a lot of people nowadays ignore like a lot of people disrespect an opinion completely just because it's not something that uh, play you know ties in with what they have so that's exactly what we have been trying to put forth all these days and i i really hope we have succeeded it to an extent but we have still a long scene in front of us in the upcoming year so in this anniversary day of argument of podcast we uh, request your wishes we request your prayers we request your support and cooperation through you know so at our journey because we have a lot more members joining us a lot more vibrant members joining us so we also want your participation in this as well and join more wishes add on to me please i'm just exhausting with all my yeah. requests people yeah so it's the, the link is still open so i think there's actually a question with regard to what i can see it's yeah. kind of similar to what it was like it's it by some man needs a job so he's basically said that congrats on one year anniversary uh, fellas you mentioned your hiring curious what kind of help are you looking out for so uh, okay so the, the one thing which we would like to like to mention with regard to uh, like we are still a student, a student run body so uh, with regard to uh, we we're trying to branch out so that's why we, we are we are trying to in in contact with lawyers with regard to uh, getting getting them for in, in the sessions or or at least starting a new series as such with regard to the uh, podcast channel as such and uh, so we are looking out for other posts especially with regard to those who are really good at editing and also with regard to uh, editing and also and also basically marketing our page because our page okay it's, it has some kind of decent kind of content or at least some meme here and there and stuff like but when the overall vibe of the page is not according to what i feel like because i am the one manage most of the time i'm managing the page so i i, I have a feel of okay, it's not really really matching as to what the kind of uh the, the kind of approach we intend to go towards so we are looking out for editors and also those who who are uh, into the into the social media uh, domain uh, as i know as as i mentioned to you we are a student run uh, body so though we have received a few application and many of them have said we are okay with all the terms as such we would love to have uh, many of you on board and we also intend like uh, I, i think uh, like we also have with us rishvi who uh, she also mentioned that we are like why are like aren't we a company and uh, I, i think in, in the beginning so like you know it's not that it's just a, small, a student run body as such but then we intend to you know branch out and, and be a dream to be a lot more bigger is what we ideally want to be and uh, i think over to rishvi and we are joined with rishvi and if you could just introduce yourself and what do you do and where where are you from which college is yes. yeah yes so okay hi everyone in the live first of all um uh, i'm rishvi parikar i'm from cmru school of legal studies so basically the only non christite on the board oh i'm also from cmru actually i was actually doing my schooling in cmru so i i I know the college way. right so you're more a part of the bunch just no no it's my yeah, life right now <laughs> so yeah and um, i'm a fourth year law student i am i basically i mean say she able to watch every kind of law but if you have to ask me what is like my major area of interest it will be like criminal law as well as civil law and um, apart from that i'm a big time geek for like everything related to psychology and astronomy and why am i here okay so that is i think a question which i also asked myself because i'm a talker i talk a lot and also because i have a lot of opinions like about everything like you ask me about something and i'm like ha oh, okay like what to say that i'm a judgmental kind of person but you know let's say like the things that happen around us then i will definitely have an opinion for the same an argumenter i think the kind of uh you know light it has got is not enough it's definitely not enough because very recently i had my first session with the team and it was awesome like you guys have no idea how awesome it was like literally like we could just like sit there and we could talk and you know it was it was not like you have to be professional like obviously you have to be like parliamentary in your language you just have to watch out so that you don't get censored but like apart from that it's like you have these bunch of people who have different ideas but they're not biased they're not opinionated towards that one particular train of thought and they're like okay this is all what we think about right 
and rather like i think nightly will, will also agree with me because she was there in the session we kept going back and forth so much that it was it was like unbelievable unbelievable because i was like oh yeah i have this particular set of views and like you know i'm pretty sure that's the correct one and then nightly would say something and then i would just be like huh but that also makes sense so uh, you know i think that is one of the main reasons why and i did not come here expecting so much liberty with like you know my thoughts but once i was a part of it and once i had my first session that's when i was like oh okay this is like you know a nice place to talk about what you as a student or like you know maybe as a citizen or maybe as a third party when you look at things how do you perceive it right and is it controversial or does it go with like the normal um, you know with like the normal understanding of the concept so i think that is the reason why i am here with argumento and trust me it's been awesome so far so that's great to, that's great to listen from you that's uh, that's a good compliment joel we got today so <laughs> really happy to hear that from you so i mean just like she, she said it's actually a cue for everybody who wants to be a part of argumento because it's all about being a family because once you've been argumento it's going to be a family you get a family mood here it's a family that studies a lot at night maybe we prepare a lot over at the night hours at you know in case of preparation of things so uh, argumento of podcast family definitely invites you to be a part of the team because if you really feel like your uh, opinion has to come forward you would like to speak about something that you are so much aware of you're so much interested in that's the whole point of uh, argumento um joel uh, do we have anybody joining in or uh... yeah we do have arthur so i think i would request uh, and since he's i think he can use vpn or whatever right? so i think he's not, he's not not able to join the the regular way so if you the three of you could just uh, leave the leave the the panel yes. and the audience so according to like the session as well sure, and I, sure. I, i mean i can i, I can add uh, according to yeah uh, rishi lord oh. is something no no i was just wondering how do we get out of this you have a- Oh, okay. Like that, that is one. Oh, cross um, there towards the right corner. Cross button. Ah, uh, cross. I yeah, like you have those buttons. Button. Never mind. Uh, Thank you so, so much, guys. So to both of us, like press the the close button, right? Yeah, yeah. Is it a close or or is you can just uh, once you close it, you will go. Maybe you go to the Instagram page. You can just join back and you you will be part of the audience okay. itself. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. Uh, I'll just try inviting Atul in the meantime, man. Atul, I hope you have received the invitation. Yeah. Ah, uh, finally, finally. Yeah. I'm really sorry, man, because uh, I was I'm having this problem with VPN issues. Yeah. So yeah, I turned it on. So now I guess yeah, it's fine, right? Yeah, yeah. Ah, uh, ah, uh, am I audible to you and everything is fine? Yeah, yeah. It's clear. It's clear right now. That's fine. Good. Yeah. All right, all right. So yeah, so here Atul is also one a new member of the podcast as such, and uh, yeah, Atul. By the way, happy anniversary! Yeah, yeah. Thank you, thank you. You also part of the same, so it's happy to you <laughs> as well. So yeah, Atul, do introduce yourself. What do you do, and uh, also what are your interests, and also what what really what what you like to do, and what really brought you to the podcast as such. Um. Yeah. So my name is Atul Vargas Sirian, and I'm coming from Kerala. and i'm in christ university uh, doing my law bblb second year first semester and uh, i don't have a current interest uh, as of now but i had an interest for sports law uh, i still have the interest in sports law uh, that's going on very well but uh, i'm also uh, developing my developing my interest in um, rare acts contracts and so uh, so yeah that's me and uh, my reason for joining argument forecast was because um uh, it was because of the memes basically uh so uh that that was the reason so i was like yeah man this is something which is really cool so i should join in and uh, that that was the reason that i actually opted to join in argument podcast yeah and how how would you say your like first session with us was uh first session was uh, really awkward <laughs> because for me i've never interviewed a guy i mean a professor or any any person before so yeah finding questions were uh, hi hi maria uh hi, hi. was difficult yeah uh the night before i asked joel a lot of questions like uh, can you ask me personal questions or so but uh, yeah he replied and say mm-hmm. yeah you can ask all these kind of questions and so but uh, again the problem was that uh uh you know i really got uh, uh not pissed off but i really didn't get it i mean i got chances but uh, of course yeah i got chances but um, i was not in 
a uh, position to answer questions or you know ask questions so 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 that is the thing and uh, i think i asked a few questions uh, in the second session yeah i did that uh, yeah, and i'm pretty happy about that so, yeah you're pretty That's happy about having questions like it's more more of a conversation we would like to have your opinion that session the in the in the session that's that you uh-huh. i think someone will do something in malayalam bro you translate that ram is <laughs> Asho, Even I didn't understand that. Asho, <laughs> I didn't understand I, what Ram is. I got a Achu Joel. I might not understand that. Ram, translate <laughs> English Ram. And then we have to join. Yeah, we are joined by one of uh, our first year classmates who uh, it isn't it Taran, yes. right? Yeah, yeah. Taran, Hi, Taran, Taran is there. Hi, Taran. Happy to be there. Okay. Yeah. Great. so uh, atul question to you because you are chosen to be a part of the social media as such okay uh, what is the bad thing about the page and what could be improved or, or, or what, what what you would like to okay. add to <laughs> content curation in the team as uh, in the page as such um i don't have an answer for that question i think uh, yeah we are moving with the current trend and stuff uh, i really love i really love that uh, yeah um uh, that's fine and the, the co- contents are really nice and uh, i think we should be moving and doing a lot of memes uh, of things because i have an interest in that so yeah <laughs> that's what i really i really love and yeah, we should actually focus on that uh, of course so uh, that was really nice um um so yeah uh, yeah that's it uh, i can't give you a perfect answer for that of course <laughs> Okay, Joel, I can't stop laughing, man. Why do you get so many messages today? Yeah, I think it's time <laughs> to take a photo. No, because Ryan is always telling before every session. Before every session, at the beginning, I used to always shave and come. So that's the I just breathe. But I was like, just uh, leave it as it is, accordingly when it, when when it should be done. <laughs> Fans are on fire. They can't see you like this. They can't take yeah, it yeah. anymore. No, no, no. <laughs> no, I don't want to do it. Are you okay? Yeah. So if it had been offline, I mean, if we had in our college, we would have had a you know a good party maybe. But one year at home, I mean, I feel bad. Okay, the whole point of argument was even yeah. Tell, yeah, I think tell we, can of, we can we can sort of like thank. I'm not saying this in a insensitive manner, but we can thank the pandemic for giving us this opportunity because we were yeah. confined to our yeah. own homes, and this idea just came out of nowhere. I was coming uh, to that exactly. Our idea was just simplifying whatever is happening. So we do know it, like we like though as law students, we are forced to read upon so many things that are happening, be it legal or your political anything. But trying to trying to simplifying it down, that's the reason why we came up with the conversational method of of um, of, of, of basically of talking about the issue as such. I think uh, thank you, Atul, once again, Atul, for the love. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, not you. In okay, the, two apples are there online. <laughs> the one in the chat board. So he's our classmate. He's our friend, also. So. All right. Great. So, um... I think we we uh, before we close. I think I would request if the audience if they have any more questions. I thought if you if you want you can stay in the in the panel or you can you can call any more more to the uh, the uh, to the audience as well. Or, or you could if you have anything to say you could. Yeah, even I have the same question. How do you get off this thing? <laughs> There's a cross. Uh, There's a cross button. Okay. Cross button. Yeah. <laughs> okay, that's it. There's a cross button on the right top of your phone. I mean, the yeah. laptop. Yeah. 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 Thank cool. you guys for making it cool and. Uh, I think before we close, if I would, we would request like for more que- like not just question but also like good feed like feedback with regard to how we can improve and despite one year why we are able to, like it's a common question like what's like I-, I would be very frank I keep I can't frequently check with regard to how are we uh, like what's the kind of uh, numbers that you're doing and it's very it's very meek I, I, I thought if you could can can also see so how can we improve be it on the uh the number side and also on the content side and and so we we will be posting the link once again if you guys would like, like to join us at argumenta podcast uh we did receive a few entries and we would request that uh, a lot more of you who are watching the live or even those who would be seeing the saved live as such if they if you would like to join us we will be putting forward the link and uh, before we close uh, yeah sneham matram sneham matram achane running out of charge bye running out okay. of charge oh Okay. So, <laughs> no, Joel. Uh, I think let the link be perennial because uh, hmm. there, you know, people get to know. Like maybe of you. Yeah, the link should be. Like, we will be, yeah. be posting the link on our bios. We will be posting the link on our bios. 
uh, at least after the live session for at least a few days we'll be putting the link so and also we'll be uh, resharing the same post which you, which you put earlier so if you'd like to join us be it for be it for being a part of the podcast session or, or example doing explainers like what nightly just did the the last one on, on the on the taxes that as a regard to border phone and everything or also if you would like to uh, start a new series so i think like uh, one thing what the what you would like to say is that uh, what are the kind of uh, future projects which you guys would be like to look forward with your document i'm putting the question to uh, open to maria and minaz and also to the audience as well if you would like to i like this to start something new uh, or or future project as such but yeah over to you guys with your future projects in in the podcast so maybe for like future projects i was thinking to have like in person podcast sessions once we get the chance to because that would be more interactive because I know it's been a year since we've started Argumento but I still feel a little rigid while talking to somebody on you know through a camera and I feel like that way we would get the essence of our views and we'll be able to share our opinions in a much more uh, comfortable environment so that's something we strive to do obviously once covid sort of uh, uh, recedes and that's one goal I think all three of us have in mind hmm Maria what about you like even i yeah and i have been dreaming this for a while because if we could you know yeah we got an opinion on the box sir tarun says an audio visual satire maybe okay fine that's a good opinion we can take that in consideration as well so uh, what i had in mind was uh, at a point where we all can go offline just like minaj had pointed out as well we can definitely have in person you know uh, in person sessions with people uh, you know it can be anyone we don't we don't just focus on celebrities or people whose voices are often listened in society but for those people who are who have something to say in mind but is not coming out because of their own restrictions so those people to those communities i think uh, once we get offline we will have this is a documentary you know a long term session a uh, good talks with people out there i'm excited to go out but i don't know when okay this question i had raised in the previous session also when we are going to go out i don't know so yes hopefully hopefully again near future offline session should come for touch wood so that's what i had in mind so yeah. yours yeah so uh, one like the kind of feedback which is is example we did a few sessions like what all did i know is we have brought guests also on our podcast so i think uh, one of the key aspects of our podcast also that we were able to bring this very prominent journalist by the name of uh, miss sandar uh, ravi shankar who had who was quite a pop uh, famous journalist especially in tamil nadu and uh, with regard to her defamation case we, we had we had a session as such and uh, also recently we had a session with you know, professor uh, with, with mr uh, subhajit uh, chanda uh, as well so like we are trying to looking uh, looking forward to more uh, guests to be a part of of the session and also if you guys would like us to uh, have or like uh, try to contact these particular guests or have them on the session as well you could let us know on the dm like i can dm three of us or you can just dm the argument thing as such and okay like we would like to just put forward some feedback with regard to uh, dms uh, especially with regard to how we can improve the page and also what kind of aspect which we should deal on on the kind of point which is raised and then some some feedback which we which i received with regard to what we can be possibly doing in the future is that uh, stressing more on the downtrodden in society because uh, maybe some of our issues might be coming out of coming out of a place wherein we are of a particular uh, Uh, standard of living or we 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 basically aren't able to really cater to those uh, who where, where the issues actually matter to them so there be those uh, especially with regard to some very hard hitting issues in 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 the country at that so we it on employment we it on 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 health on on several other aspects of the country as such so we would be looking forward with regard to uh, going with uh, projects towards the downtrodden as such like what like what arun said with regard to the satire also works good i'm not a, i'm not a funny bone so maybe the two of them can can do it as such uh, that, oh that, no you are i think uh, joel's one well flourished page is coming up uh, joel give uh, you know name it as well for them because it's a very interesting page i mean yeah <laughs> we can okay, relate a, to it as well okay <laughs> i may not be someone who can like say the funny thing but that what i keep on trying to like edit and do some things like so that there's actually one page called uh, dinga in underscore edit so you can check it out i'm going to try and plug in my page if you guys want to check it out uh, they called dinga edit but anyway that with that aside uh, like uh, also uh, we will we'll be starting a new series especially with regard to uh, movies and book recommendations as well 
Uh, I know that we are we aren't experts with regard to critiquing or talking about it, but basically with regard to the general perspective of it. So I'm like uh, basically I'm trying trying to bring in the uh, aspect of start, starting political movies, a movie which came up in a, in a particular time and was not recognized, and basically those stuff which are pertaining to legal and political and social issues as such, and uh, also uh, these are the. Well, basically, we we might think of trying to you know uh, have 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 direct interactions with the common people as such. Than staying on our uh, uh, phone screens or laptop screens, so basically talking to me about certain issues. I'm not saying the scoop loop, scoop loop level of you know putting the mic on someone and trying to trying to ask them about what the particular issue is, but then basically having an uh, interaction with common as such, and that's what we are striving to for. Like we the 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 reason why I came, we all came up with that the kind of knowledge or the kind of thing which, which are reading instead of keeping it with ourselves, just putting it out to the audience as such is what. Uh, we came up with with, with exactly. such. That's one of our uh, future plans. And also, one more key thing: if uh, if any of the audience members also would like, because we also need to see one more feedback. That why not start some content in regional languages as well? So be it Hindi or or Tamil or Malayalam or English. So we would like to start with start it as well. So basically, uh, uh, trying to, uh, trying to try, trying to pander to that particular uh, the, the the content. As per that particular language, so that's a really great start. Because English is not something just a, a, a language which, which which most commoners know. Everyone can and access. Can yeah. yeah. So the, the access level is what we're trying to look out for, trying to trying to pander. So, so we would be. This is a very broad uh, aspect which we're which we're putting forward in this live. So I think if I miss out anything, uh, my my minister can also point out as well. So we. No, I think you've pretty much covered everything. And exactly. Yeah, You've covered a bit of it. I mean, yeah, we can, we it's something that has to come in future. I mean, depending yeah. upon uh, how situations would be, like, okay. will my offline dream come true ever in my life? All these things will have to come on its way. So, expecting for the best, guys. And once again, uh, anniversary wishes to our team, Argument of Podcast, uh, the three co-founders and the three and the amazing people who are going to join our family super soon. to all those viewers who have been supporting us all these while who have been sharing us you know sharing the content in your stories in your status because every single minute you spent for us value is a lot and thank you so much for it and uh, we really really expect to you know to not to disappoint you ever to make you happy to make you satisfied with our content so looking forward to it you guys also a send up for everyone please yeah yeah minaj before yeah i think like maria stressed upon in the beginning of the session we're just grateful for everything you've given us and argumenta wouldn't be what it is today one year later without your viewership without your support without your feedback and on that note one thing i would like to tell all of you is that this is in team argumenta everybody with an opinion on something that's happening around you everybody that wants to stand up to something wrong happening around you is an argumenter and that's the spirit we we would like to inculcate in everybody to have an opinion to stand for the good and to educate people around you yeah so thank that's you that's so nice all, that touched me that's really nice <laughs> <laughs> i was touched go ahead joel Thank you, guys. One thing for joining us in the live, and I think we shall now be closing it. So you will find this particular yes. session also on, like, say, on on IUTV and also on YouTube and Spotify as well. Do we would we would like it? I there was this particular aspect of at least reaching the hundred subscriber before we start the live, but then, uh, but then uh, we it's not it it didn't happen as, as and when it happens, and we will be able to see more numbers. Slow and steady well. wins the race. We'll peacefully wait. No problem. <laughs> So okay. Do, do do follow our page. Those who are uh, new to our uh, new to our Instagram page as well. Take out of the live also for for more interesting content. And also, if you like any memes or if you like to uh, uh, you know address particular top uh, issues or topics at hand, please DM the three of us or at least DM the page. We can be we accordingly taken. Also, one more thing before we leave is that the link with regard to joining the the argument group podcast also will be put forward. uh after the link so who was interested to be a part of it beat editors or beat being a part of being an argumenter and also holding explainers and everything will also be there and uh, until then do subscribe to our youtube channel and also uh follow our page and also listen to our podcast on spotify youtube igtv on apple itunes and everything so yeah thanks once again okay guys. thank, thank you, you so much for joining bye bye see ya hello and welcome to argumenter podcast 
And as you all know, we are a podcast day to discuss, deliberate and debate on several social, legal and political issues. So, our episodes are available on YouTube, on Spotify, on IGTV and several other podcast platforms as well. So, this current episode, the full length, will be available on YouTube and also you will be able to find the latest updates about the session as well on Instagram and other platforms as well. So, do like, share and subscribe to our channel on YouTube and also follow our Instagram page with regard to regular updates as well.